a shot he never hit as a rookie. Seven points a game, nine points a game, nine and a half, and then this year, 14. He's going to dunk it. It slipped out of his hand. Curry behind the back, Clay Thompson reversing it in. So Trey Burton, the draft pick is healthy. Clay Thompson off the boat and delivery again. And you can bet that one was not going to be short. You have said for so long, Jim, that there are shooting percentages and there's the wide open shooting percentage. Loses Burks, sets up Clay Thompson, hangs home the three. Clay Thompson hitting the three out of the timeout. Glass. Clay Thompson over Lucas. Clay Thompson catch and shoot. Deep two. And he's got 22. Ray Thompson thought about it. Reload. Good. 15. Play the D. Get out of the break. And find those lethal shooters. As voted on by you, the fans, Clay Thompson. 25 point night. Five of eight on threes. Four rebounds, two assists. The usual good defense. And he continues this marvelous beginning to the third year of his career. First of all, the efficiency has been extra special this year. What's the reason? Uh, just being more patient, taking better shots, um, getting stronger. And we got, you know, Andre Iguodala now. He makes my job a lot easier. The, they shot the three unexpectedly well. Do you adjust something since you're going to see them again Monday night, or do you play them as normal and figure it's going to go back to the norm? We played them as normal. I thought I did was great. You know, I think we held them down to 40% shooting. Uh, they had 88. I mean, they had 88. You know, but uh, yeah, we played well on the defensive end. So no, not that big adjustments. You know, maybe on some plays, uh, guard the ball screen, but that's about it. Unfortunately, we've we've had this experience before with Brandon Rush last year. What was it like for you guys to see Jermaine O'Neal go down like that? It's never good seeing you know a teammate go down. I know he's gonna be all right. He's a tough dude, and uh, you know I, I, I hope the best for J.O. He's a great great leader. This is a third team in a row that comes in sort of undermanned, under talented. You guys, unlike last year, have really been able to sort of stay, stay focused and and knock them out, keep them at bay. What's been the difference this year? Well, uh, you know, we realize if you want to be great, you got to beat the team you're supposed to beat and battle the good teams on the road. So we're doing that this year. We got to continue to do it Monday. Congratulations. Good luck Monday night. All right. Thank you. Bob. All right, Rick.